Today we're talking with Marie Lavender, best-selling multi-genre author of the Upon Your Return and 21 other books. She received the Mystery Blogger Award for 2017. She's an A to Z Blog Challenge Survivor in 2016. And in March of 2016, she was crowned Empress of the Universe. Uh, that was winner of the Broken Heart Theme Contest and a winner of I Love You Themed Contest on Soul to Universe. Well, I'm very fascinated with this. Interest of the Universe title. Can you tell us about that, Marie? Um, yes, I can. So basically, it was I was in this Facebook group. Um, I I have a secret love for poetry, so I was in this poetry group, and the moderator was running a contest for um, the best poem for each of those themes. So one was about, um, you know being heartbroken and the other one was was like more romantic so um for both of those i submitted poems and i think there were like a thousand members in the group and um i think i think each contest ran for a few weeks or something and um so i think they tagged me in the group to tell me that i'd won (laughs) a couple of times and so I was like, I'll just add this to my, you know, awards list or whatever. But I just thought it was kind of cool, and I did a couple blog posts about it as well. So, um, yeah, it, it's been a while, but uh, people can look back through my archives and see, like, what exact poem won and everything. So Awesome. Well, I, I wish I could get a, a, uh, a title like that. It's pretty cool. So tell us a little bit more about yourself. Okay. I am from a pretty small town in the Midwest. Um, I live with my family and three cats. As you can see, there's Emma, Smokey, and Kit. Well, Katarina is her name, but we we shortened that to Kit. (laughs) Okay. And um, I love writing, reading, shopping, shopping. don't get me started on shopping. <laughs> Don't give me a credit card. <laughs> um, I also love doing a lot of different creative product projects, um, some at home, um, like home decor or something. And I've also designed book covers, promotional teasers, and book trailers. Yes, I those, and they're very good. Oh, thank you so much. Mm-hmm. Um, I've always known I wanted to be a writer um, from the age of nine. Mm-hmm. And I, I think a lot of us start out <laughs> pretty young like that. Mm-hmm. Um, I am a multi-genre author of 22 books in the categories of historical romance, contemporary romance, romantic suspense, paranormal romance, fantasy, science fiction, mystery thriller, dramatic fiction, literary fiction, and poetry. Um, I also moderate three blogs, Writing in the Modern Age, uh, Marie Lavender's Books, and the I Love Romance blog. And for each of those, we've had um, a lot of guest authors. Um, For Writing in the Modern Age and for the I Love Romance blog, we've had, I think, 90 authors per year. Um, and that doesn't really count, like, when we run, um, huge book giveaways and things. Um, I've won blog prizes as well as author and book awards. You've read some of those on my bio. Um, my current published book series are the Heiresses and Love series, the Magic series, the Blood at First Sight series, and the Code of End of Our series. I have many other series in project progress, such as a romantic comedy set of books called the Misfits series, and that's about um, six friends and their each of their individual stories. And then um, in the future, I'll also have a paranormal series titled Spells and Shift- Shifters, a six 
book historical romantic fantasy series titled The Witches of Moonhaven. The Anatolian Stone series, which is about time travel. And a historical Western romance trilogy called The Ladies of the West series. I have standalone books as well. You can see a full list of my 119 works in progress on the projects and writing page of my author website, which is marielavender.com. Um, and then, oh yeah, I love hot pink, although I'm a fan of most colors. Mm-hmm. Awesome. Okay, let me get back here to uh, our next question. Well, you have a you had a new release out, correct? I do. Yeah. So tell me about that book. Okay. Um, the new release is called Directions of the Heart. This is a modern romantic drama collection. Each story deals with trauma in some manner. Um, the set of stories, or novellas really, is dark and emotional but still romantic. The book just came out on July 25th. Um, the novel has, re- or the collection has received um, five star reviews so far and even earned the top one. Top 10 book of 2017 on Amy's Bookshelf Reviews blog. Great. Now, well, I'll tell you a little bit about why you decided to put this collection of books together. Um, I think I was inspired a lot by, um, well, personal experiences, but also... Um, things you see on the news and everything, current events. And um, I wanted to give a voice to survivors of trauma. And, well, I guess you could say I pushed boundaries with this one. (laughs) So it's definitely different than my other books. It's a little more raw. Um, Mm -hmm. But I fell in love with the characters, relating to them like they were friends or even family members. And I really enjoyed telling their stories. So. I understand. So you have written 21 books, right? Uh, 22, yeah. 22 books. Yo, I published, yeah, 22. Yeah, published 22. And you have a whole lot in the works, I can hear. Oh, yeah. We're saying about what's coming up. And um, people uh, must or would be interested in knowing what your writing process is. How do you accomplish so much? Um, well, I do get ideas from real life. Um, like I said, I am inspired by my own ex- own experiences as well as people I know. And, um, of course, current events inspire me to write about what's going on. There are other moments when, like, an idea will just emerge from this jumble of chaos in my brain. <laughs> Uh, stories often come to me in a random fashion, and so I try to write everything down so I don't forget while I'm, you know, in that loop of creativity. Um, when I'm focused on writing a book, I try to get a little done each day, whether it's a scene, a chapter, or, you know, I'm just researching different aspects of it. Um, so I write everything that I can, and then I break down and write a, an outline so I can organize my thoughts a little bit. And that uh-huh. helps me um, fill in all the gaps that, that might be in there, you know. So um, mm-hmm. then when the book is finished, I take a break for a while before I start editing. So, Ah, uh, yes. <laughs> I understand that. And here we have a whole list of places where you can purchase directions of the heart. And, of course, you can find your other books in these same places, I guess, Amazon, Smashwords, Barnes & Noble, Kobo, and Create Space. Mm-hmm. Right? Okay. Yeah, most so of them, yeah. mm-hmm. Most of them are on, on all of these areas here. But I guess, too, if they couldn't find something, they could go to your website? Yeah. Um, so, like, marielavender.com slash um, my slash about slash my books, I believe. 
well, the My Books page lists all of them. <laughs> so, okay. yeah, and it has all of the purchase links on each one. So, yeah. And, uh, you know, I noticed that you have the your cats outlined in pink. Didn't you tell me something about <laughs> your favorite color? Everybody wants to know your yeah. cat's favorite color. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's my favorite color. <laughs> And this picture you gave me to illustrate yeah. the pink, your favorite color, what story is behind this? Oh, what story is behind the picture? Or The picture with all the pink in it. Where did you find that? Um, I just randomly searched for hot pink images online, and I thought, well, that one's really cool and mysterious. <laughs> so I Ooh, threw that it one is. in. You know. I know. That's what I love about it is how mysterious it looks. It would make me want to read your book. <laughs> just looking at just looking at that thing. Whoa, there's, there's going to be something cool inside those books. So, I'll, I'll tell you, Marie, um, it, it's such a pleasure getting to know you, and I want to thank you so much for coming on today and uh, telling our listeners about you and your books and your cats. Well, <laughs> we love cats here. <laughs> <laughs> I love cats, yeah. <laughs> yes, we do too. We do too. So well, thank you so much for joining us today. And I understand we'll probably see you at, um, we're also going to see you during the book release for uh, The Patron's Wife on August 7th, right? You could come visit us on Facebook and chat with people. Yeah, I'll just pop in there. So Yeah. And and of course everyone will let you know that she's giving away directions of the heart at this uh book release event. So if you are dying to get a copy of it, you can come and join the challenge. There'll be some sort of challenge for you to accomplish, but you may be able to get a uh, pretty copy of directions of the heart. Thank you again, Marie. You had a wonderful day. You too. Thanks for inviting me. Bye. Bye.